Hello again, everyone. It is your Black Knight. And we're hanging out here. We're back to the agency. And I don't know how long Imani needs to go through those tapes. It's actually been a couple days since I played here. But there seems to be some benefit to doing the security contracts, the, you know, the, the lower level stuff. Every one you do increases your your rate per hour of making money in your in your safe. Think here we have the safe, two hundred fifty dollars. It, it goes to two hundred fifty thousand. We can leave that there. But if I complete another contract, then it goes to like seven hundred and fifty per hour, or something along those lines. And then I forget the exact math. But up to you can you, if you keep doing them, you know I think if you do like five hundred missions or something like that, you'll eventually make it fifty thousand an hour, which is kind of a lot. So I'm not saying that you should grind this until you get there like crazy. Liquidize access. Asset protection's annoying. From what I hear, recover the stolen vehicle, blow stuff up. Let's do the blow stuff up. Let's, we've got the Deluxo. We can just blow stuff up. Is that, is that an elevator? That would be really nice if there was like an elevator right there. Now it's just doors. Equipment added satchel charges. I'm blowing. Thanks. I'm blowing things up. I can think around. And maybe this is the completely wrong vehicle. But that's what we're gonna do. We won't even use the satchel charges. We'll just have them. We'll put them back on the shelf. Suddenly, I have a bag. All right. Look, suit up. We got some Meriwether mess to clean up. Seems like those fools got some new surveillance project running. Cameras snooping all over everywhere. And if there's one thing that the A-listers I know don't want in this town, it's a shit ton of video evidence. Hey, every client I got, they want this fucking thing burned down. My phone been ringing off the fucking hook. Look, Imani's got the name of the guy running the project. So tell his ass back to the base, get in there, wipe out the whole surveillance equipment, and torch that motherfucking place. Okay. I want to tell somebody. Easy to do it from the air. We'll cruise through the air, flying about. See how maybe you have to be, you know, if you go too high, it might not trigger. So we'll have to. Tail the Meriwether region. Okay. There he is. And he's in a Jeep. This could be a pretty long drive. But the flying mode of the Deluxo seems to match his speed pretty well. And it keeps you safe from detection because you're high up enough. He's, uh, he's stopping at stoplights. Okay. That's fine. And, you know, this is... Meriwether's a private industry sort of thing, so if they suffer a massive financial setback, they're not going to reinvest, so... Until the next time this mission comes up. <laughs> One does wonder how far they're going to drag us along and where this is set up. What are we blowing up?
Went up into the hills? No. Well, he's booking. At least he didn't have him drive normally. I think we must be getting close. Enter the underground base, okay. Dun 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 flip bang okay there you go I'm anticipating issues Can we stealth for this? Or is it just immediately bullets in the face? Bullets in the face? I'm expecting bullets in the face. <coughs> so many bullets in the face. Ah! Okay. Destroy the surveillance. Wait a minute, this is the... This looks just like my, uh... My special vehicle garage. What the hell? They didn't even react. Hello? Are, are we... What the hell? Alright, guys, the, your, your detection on this is just bizarre. Like, I shot him, he was invincible, and then you walk up and then they kill you. It's... Where's the darn entrance? There it is. Okay, let's just, let's just do this. Satchel charges. Need to blow the whole place up? Who's shooting me? I need to kind of reevaluate here because I don't know who the hell is still living. You're hiding in a corner somewhere. Dickhead. Not arguing with you. My character is a terrible person. Oh, there you are. Still one more. But where? he hiding? Bastard. 
must be over there. Oh, go run! As I dropped it at my feet. Nice touch. There's not a lot of place to hide here, gang. Did we get them? All right, maybe, maybe that last uh, that last volley. Oh, here. Satchel charge. Satchel charges. It's going to drop the whole place, I guess. Oh dear! Run faster! Use the faster run mode. Lose the cops, good vehicle for it. So we want homing. Hey, we get out to the boat. It should have air defenses turned on, I think. I think I had that turned on for... Someone was I thought was on my boat. I just basically trapped him there, but that's Let's see, are your defenses on? Uh oh Oh well I'm in a vehicle? That's bizarre, okay. And they're shut down. And so I can approach. Alright, so we did a thing. And that should increase the amount of money per hour that's made. Now, when will we get the call? Information on GT Online updates can be accessed by highlighting a contact or series blue on the pause. Alright. Don't know what that even means. I mean, it's... Oh, it... Hey, look, good shit on those contracts you've been working on. But listen, I got some other work. A certain kind of work that needs a certain kind of person. You know what I mean? Big ticket type shit. I don't want to say too much on my cell, so I'll be in touch with you on a payphone. Keep your ears open. Okay. That's kind of a, a very much an old throwback to the old GTA days. Because I've been pretty much just a complete psychopath here. I don't, hell, the money, I just blow stuff up. No problem. Kill people. No big deal. Nothing completely psychotic about all the stuff that's going on in this game. No, it's... I realize that's the point. Let's see, I've been shot up a bit, but it doesn't mean I can't work on the car. Just I've been repeatedly shot. Makes sense, right? Any cars to work on? 
This thing just exploded. Okay, we got two cards to Tauros. Server, service vehicle, respray. Racing green. Performance upgrades, street suspension, street brakes. Because you're going to drive it on the street, EMS 1. We don't want to go too fast. Roof, sports roof. Exhaust, tri vector exhaust. Skirts. Take it a secondary skirt because the colors are all the same anyway. So, wheels, style new wheels, off road makes sense. Heavy duty steely. Uh, let's see, how's the color look on that? It's Christmassy, we'll let it go. Skirts for a secondary race skirt. Did I do something wrong? Skirts. Oh, secondary extended skirt. Secondary race skirt. Okay, we did almost the wrong skirt. Yeah, let's deliver it because why not? We're killing time here until we get called back. And the high end stuff is usually pretty close. It's the cheaper cars that you have to drive forever. That might be just a, a function of where I've got my uh, my shop. And the Tauros isn't a bad car to drive. It's pretty quick, so it's not a great car driving. It does have it does suffer from some advanced handling flags, but if you're, as far as it's not. It's not a, uh, a weenie issy classic, you know what I'm saying? Watch it for how long? I did just drive through a park, so I guess that counts. That's they're not wrong. Hey, it's easier than doing all the daily objectives, right? As long as it doesn't glitch out. Let's see if it accepts the car. There you go, your Christmas special. You all ready for Christmas? Merry Christmas now. Alrighty. Make a little money back. We're down to We're down about ten million on this so far, I'd say. Ten, eleven million. And what was that? Oh there you go. She's happy. I'm so glad. Come on now, when are we getting uh, the VIP contract thing? Oh, we're close enough to the agency we go back. That might have been long enough that we could do another contract. If the another, another service contract, if we don't have the big deal going on. Oh wait, oh there's a payphone lit up. Well that'll be different. Where is the payphone? Do you even see it? Oh there it is. Let's get down with our GTA cells. Hey, so when was the last time you used the payphone? Cause believe me, there's some things you don't want the FIB to hear. 
You know, things like contract killings, stock manipulation. You feel me? Because, see, I knew the dude that used to run the hits in this town, and he knew something most of the hatchet guys out there don't. The money only starts flowing when the stock market gets involved. Now, I got my share of high net worth individuals in my contact these days. And since we got our own partnership up and running, a few of them start hitting me up with propositions that be making me think shit. I need to get back in the game. With me running the plays and you working the fields, man. So look, here's the deal. We take out some assholes who fucking deserve it anyway, which fixes the market in our own clients' favor, and then they send us some serious pay dirt. You got me? All you got to do is pick up the phone. I'll give you the mark, and then I'll text you some details from the burner. You can do it however you want, but the clients pay extra if you do it just right. Sounds good? Darling, I'm on a phone. Heard of the show called Closet CEO, where some asshole billionaire pretends to be one of his broke ass employees for a day or two. Well, keep thinking about that, and then think about the CEO of Gold Coast Development. This dude is a world class asshole, union busting. Poor working conditions, corruption, intimidation, man, you name it. And check this out. Now he about to throw in some overalls and play nice for the workers on his site for the cameras. Now, full disclosure, I did some work a while ago that gave this asshole market value a boost. But that was before I heard what a piece of shit this fucker really is. So when a client came to me with a proposal to make some bills off liquidating his ass, man, I said, hell yeah. Our client gonna short the fuck out the Gold Coast development stock. Then we gonna ice this fool while he's playing construction working for this dumbass show. The stock tank, our client get rich, we get paid. And if we make it look like he died because of some unsafe conditions on his site, makes it even better. Okay. The CEO. CEO versus the CEO. So what do we do here now? Assassinate the target, but they gotta tell us how we're we supposed to get the extra bonus money. I can just put a missile in him and I'll get, I think it's like 15 grand or something like that. Use a scoped rifle to take out the target with a gas tank explosion! Oh, well, that, that sounds like not a bad mission. Timed. So we have to hustle it. I mean, we should be able to get anywhere in two minutes with this thing. Flying straight across. I think the assassination bonuses are pretty big, too. So it's worth doing it, the, the way they say. How far? Where is this guy working? I like to make it look like an accident, but but you, you can really tell here that um, Franklin has gone full blown uh, sociopath or psychopath or however. Just no, no remorse whatsoever. Okay, where's the equipment stash nearby? You see on the map? Oh, there it is. Okay, well, that's, see, that gives us a good vantage point. That tells us where the good vantage point is. So we're gonna we're gonna avoid overflying this guy. Aha! Top of a tower. I like it. There you go. In case you had any questions, I mean, th there's just no morality. It's almost like, you know, you, I, I've always, I think I've talked about it before, a theory that all these people are really in hell. But, you know, I have another, you know, because you keep respawning. No one does anything but, but cruelty. But the other, the other thing that you could look at is that maybe they all know they're in a video game. I didn't mean to shoot that. Where's the target? 
Oh, there he is. Well, I mean, if he if he's not in position, was it? Is there a gas tank thing? No one seems panicked from the silenced shot. Does he need to go further? Oh, there. So eventually he's going to wander over. Come on, wander over by the gas. Having a cigarette. And we got the bonus. He lit a cigarette. And boof. Leave the area. Oh, we have to leave the area. Ooh, that hurt. I was sliding down pretty fast there. And then... Now, seems like it's hard on the ankles. The whole lifestyle, you know? But if all these people know they're in a video game that nothing matters, if they figured out that they're, they're trapped in the Matrix... Which is why when people suggest that we're actually in the Matrix and this is all a simulation, it's a very dangerous thought because you don't want people working on that basis. I oh, about a $70,000 bonus payment. That's, that's a pretty good chunk of change. Funhouse is at 44000 I heard those are supposed to have increased. What's our um, dailies? Client job? No, we're not doing any of that. I tell you what, it doesn't look like... Oh, here we go. Hey, what's up? Just calling to say well done with that recent business venture of ours. Shit, you should have the money by now. And I just want to say the client was very pleased with your intention to detail. But look, keep your ears to the ground for more work, all right? Or hit me up anytime and I'll see what I got for you. So you can call in if you want to do that. It's not just randomly happening. That's a pretty easy 85k. Survival, sort of bad girls in Russia. No, we're not doing that. That's... Someone's just trying to just troll them to get people to try out their thing. I can't imagine you have a survival where you're just attacked by girls or something like that, but... Even so, do you really want to be involved? No, no, I don't want to know about it. Well, if I'm honest, I kind of planned on uh, on doing another one of the main the main you know quest kind of things this morning, but it didn't seem to be gelling. I'm pretty much out of time here. You know, it's an early morning run. You only have so much time to do these things. We'll get something else later this afternoon, maybe if I'm lucky. I I haven't been. It's been busy. I believe. It's been busy times. So what we'll do is we'll grab this money. I don't know, do I want to see, let it run and see what the new cap is? Did it tell you? Yeah, we'll figure it out later on, I guess. Probably a lot. One night when I'm idling. Haven't been idling in a while. Or I'll just Google it. You can just Google everything. You know, it's, what's the new... What's the new limits?
And you think we'll even get the phone call this session? I'm gonna probably have to wrap it up. But we'll tell you what we're gonna do. We're gonna grab the money here and deposit it. And then me I'll set to a nightclub so I can, if there's nothing else going on the next time I go in, I can at least do some some nightclub missions and keep the popularity up. Yeah, but yeah, we could do one now. I think I have enough time for now. I don't know. That's kind. Of, that's kind of too close. Next time round. So we just made 160k there, just picking up money and making it look like a guy blew himself up smoking. Well, all righty then, as Jim Carrey would say. That's good. Good to see you. On that note, ladies and gentlemen, I think we'll call this good. This is your Black Knight. Have a great night.